Salutations, this is Grim Davel. Welcome back to our Let's Play of Dwarf Fortress, Island Embark. So if you've been following along, the last episode, we had uh, quite, quite the tragedy. Uh, not only you see that little uh, dwarf with the exclamation mark running around who is both hungry and dehydrated, that is, um, that is one of our very favorite dwarves, Friendly, who has gone stark raving mad, uh, running around babbling, as you can see, uh, all because uh, he had a, got, a, got inspired to build something, something wonderful it probably would have been. He claimed this uh, mason's workshop, and uh, then, uh, not, not, not up here, but right here, and uh, wanted to make something out of stone and bone, but we did not have any stone for him to build his masterpiece, and so he went insane uh we tried to build a restraint here and we did build a restraint here but i don't think there's any way we can actually restrain him uh, it's possible that if we had a cage uh which i don't think we do although you know what now that i say that let me just double check i thought we needed um cage oh i can put down a cage i'm gonna try that i'm gonna try putting down a cage and we'll see if we can assign the cage to him. That's possible. But I think that for the re as far as the restraints go, unless he actually commits a crime, and then we have a sheriff um, to uh, like arrest him, I don't think we can actually restrain him. We uh, we have this we have the uh, restraints set to be used for justice. Um, can I set owner? Hmm. Let me turn that off and put set owner. Yeah, let me try this. Um, and the owner will be friendly. Let's try that. You can assign an animal to it, but obviously uh, friendly is not an animal. The other tragedy is that Snowflake, not our favorite dwarf, but you know, still a valued member of our community, she died. She was uh, in the treetops, somehow got stuck in the treetops, tree tops, I assume, while catching fruit. There's even a kitten up here with her. And we didn't know she was there. We got no notifications, or at least none that I noticed. And uh, she starved. We, fa we found out that she was there too late. And uh, by the time we realized it was too late to do anything. And uh, now all we can do is uh, mine out uh, an area here for tombs for both... Well, a tomb for Snowflake and a tomb for, also for Friendly, because he will probably go insane. And, well, you'll, you'll probably, I'm sorry, he is insane. He will probably die, and there's nothing we can do about it. Okay, they installed this cage. Can we assign it to a dwarf? No. No, we cannot. We cannot assign it to a dwarf. Not... Not that I can see anyway. Hold on. Or make room. I, we could also add this to the room. Uh, and a, put the owner as friendly, just like we did with this thing. But I don't know if anyone will actually move him in there. Uh, okay, so we're mining out this tomb, and I guess we'll put Friendly in the first tomb. And while we're doing that, uh, let me... Uh, we still have a bit of aquifering to do. We don't have... If, it's not quite as uh, uh, time-sensitive as it was before when we were trying to race against the clock for the sake of Friendly Sanity, uh, trying to get stone in time. We failed there, as we knew we probably would. But we're going to continue with our little experiment, uh, trying to... Trying to fix what I've what I did and and just kind of like wall it off, starting from here and going all the way over here. So we'll keep doing that. And uh, we got some miasma down here. Uh, there's not much I can do about it, just because it just requires hauling. We just don't have the dwarves to to haul. Um, they're doing it as best they can, but we we uh, we killed a lot of we butchered a lot of turkeys here, and a lot of stuff is just being just getting rotted unfortunately so it's not being not even being used to cook which is okay i think we're we're doing just fine on food uh for now but um we really we did it uh to get stacks of bone was the main reason we did it and also to just to clear up our like mass of turkeys here 
Um, we thought we would need the bone for the uh, for friendly for his masterpiece, whatever he wanted to create. But again, that was a failure. Okay, so let's build a casket. I think it's K. Nope, that's a kennel. Uh, er, bury uh, the end. Yeah, there we go. Burial receptacle, right there. Um, oh, whoops. I wanted to look at expand. There we go. Okay, they're all about the same quality. This one's closest. We'll put that in there. Oh, and uh, let's get some doors here. A couple of Citron doors. There we go. Whoops. There we go. And I believe this must be Ryzen here, right? Oh, uh, sorry, Bullhead. <laughs> I'm still calling him by his original name. But yeah, by Bullhead. Bullhead, I'm thinking, will probably become our manager. I could be wrong, but that's what I'm thinking. In fact, I think we need to set one. Oh, no. Oh, yeah, we actually set... I'm sorry, I forgot that we already did that. Uh, obviously, this is like... Uh, I haven't played in about a week, so... Bullhead, we will we will make... Uh, we have made our manager. Um, I don't know how long it'll take him to train up some of those skills, but that's what it is. I'm trying to see yeah, if there's anything here, like in the combat logs, about... Yeah, there's nothing about um, Snowflake and what happened to her. I don't know. Uh, all right. Uh, okay, Serenity's doing that. So let's mine uh, this and this. Cool. And uh, hopefully Bullhead will come down and help out with that. What did we do here? Oh, yeah. So we did this to make more... Oh, yeah, yeah. I think we wanted to make, like, a dining room and a, a nice bedroom, maybe, for a sheriff. Because a sheriff needs needs that stuff. I'm pretty sure that's why we did that. Although, right now, I'm not sure if that's the best use of our time. Yeah, I'm just going to keep going. I don't think... I don't think there's anything we can do about Friendly, quite honestly. Uh, he's just running around babbling. And we already tried to take, like, military action. We put, um, we put Scat in a, in a squad. And, uh, we could have him, like, attack him. But we can't have him, we can't set it to arrest. Unfortunately. Yeah. We could say attack. And kill creature at current, but not, Yeah. That's it. So Friendly is going to die. Man, it's just sad. He was probably he was probably my favorite dwarf. He was just a super nice dwarf. Uh, and he did a good job. So that means that we're down to five dwarves. That's uh, Bullhead Serenity, Scat Indigo. Or wait, are we down to four? We are, we're down to four dwarves. Yeah, we're down to four dwarves. Which isn't great, but uh, it's you know, that's uh, that's Dwarf Fortress for you. Okay, we're still setting that to be mined. So, so it looks like uh, this this piece just got mined out, and I don't know if they're going to be able to mine this out. There's only one here, but over here it's six. Uh, six. Yeah, it doesn't look like. It doesn't look like they're able to get over here. Because it's 7 out of 7 here. Oh. Um, I think she's stopped pumping. Yeah, she stopped pumping. So we'll see when she starts pumping again. Okay, she's pumping again. Why is this whole area filled with water? Oh. Oh. Right. Okay. So now what, I, what I've done is water is pumping up from... The, where the X is going into here but the thing is now this is connected now it's connected so the water is just going back up here well isn't that fun uh, what we need to do is make this a ramp I don't know if it's possible um, let's see up ramp Uh, 
I don't know if that actually did anything. I don't think it did. Um, build construction ramp. No, there's water there. Okay. Let me think about this. Um... <laughs> so again, this is just another thing that I did not foresee happening with, with our plan. Um, hmm. Okay, whoops, stop. What if we really just need to get rid of this block here? Maybe we can deconstruct it now. Um, although I don't think so. It usually takes a long time to get rid of constructions, right? Uh, yeah, so if we remove construction right here, honestly, I don't think they're going to be able to do it. It's going to be too much. They can't even get over there because of the water pressure. She's as like, as soon as she starts pumping, she starts like getting pushed. It looks like, which is not cool. Where is she? Where'd she go? Did she run away? I hope she ran away. Um, mm. All right, well, for one thing, let's remove the designation right here. I could build a wall. I don't know if I can even build a wall anymore because of the water pressure. Look what I've done. That was really foolish. Um, wow. I think I, I, I might have just destroyed everything. I might have just ruined the entirety of the plan. All right, let's stop pumping. I stop pumping, right? Yeah. Stop pumping. Oh, God, did you see that? Someone's drowning. Okay, she's fine. She's fine. She escaped. She escaped. This is all flooded now. And because of what I did, I can no longer actually use the screw pump. Because they are no longer separate basins. Because I seriously messed up. Because I wasn't thinking. Um, hmm, okay, so if we were to, the only thing I can think to do is move a pump up here again and pump, build walls down here and try to expand out this area. And then once we expand that out, try to expand this out. Ah. <laughs> uh, <laughs> I really don't know. I feel like I just put the final nail in the coffin here when I mine this, this piece out. It was pretty bad. I think that I, I don't know what else to do. I think I, I think that's it. I think I have totally screwed ourselves. Um, hmm. We could put a block here. No, because the, the water would still come through the screw pump, right? And like flood over it. I don't know. Maybe I'll try that. Maybe I'll try putting a, a wall right there. Let's see, build, construction, wall. Can I just put it? No, I gotta first remove the stairs. That's okay. Uh, remove construction right here. So we'll remove those stairs, put a wall there, and then we'll try pumping again. That's my plan. Um, I just want the water to not prevent, you know, to not stop the... Uh, not stop the uh, screw pump or uh, the person that's screw the dwarf that's screw pumping pot that's yeah okay uh all right we still haven't put that coffin there that casket oh there she's doing it now 
And uh, let's also put another one here for the inevitable. And doors. Let's make them the same kind of wood. Okay. Okay. So now let us make it a tomb that big. And we're going to assign it to Snowflake. Cool. And at some point, they'll be able to retrieve that body. I, w I started making uh, a way to get up, right? So this is uh, this goes up. All right. Uh, did I try to make one somewhere else? I think. That's a downward stair? Why would I put a downward stair there? That was foolish. Let's re remove that. And uh, let's put an upward stair right here. Yeah, build, construction, upstair. Uh, yeah, let's put it right here. Blocks, okay. I don't know what I was thinking there. I wonder if that's what I used to try to get her to come down in the first place. Probably. Okay. Oh, okay, we have this one too. Let's just, I'm just going to assign this to friendly right off, even though he's not dead yet. He will just have that assigned for whenever he dies. Okay. How are we doing here? Okay, build construction wall right here. Okay. And they should be able to do that. Okay. All right. And can you get our body yet? No. Build. Um, and here we can build a, a downstair right here. And I think once that's there, they should be able to get the body. We'll find out. Oh man, I can't believe we only have four doors left. Okay, so we have a wall there. And I don't know if this will work, but let's start pumping again and see if she gets pushed around when she does that. All right, Serenity, whenever you're ready. I think Serenity might be our only... I don't know if anyone else is set to do pump operating, but... Everyone's still just hauling around stuff. Okay, we have that there. Uh, I don't know if we, I don't know if they can walk across uh, these twigs. I think not. So let me build a little floor also. Uh, construction floor right there. Um, and we'll see if you can get it once you do that. The cats should be able to come up and down because cats are legendary climbers. Although that's the same... I don't know. It looks like the cat's stuck in a tree. Maybe cats get stuck in trees. Look at all these cats running around. Okay. Uh, no one's pumping yet. If they can remove, if we can make this a ramp, we could turn the pump around, but I don't think we're going to be able to. In fact, all we're doing is making it harder. We're just putting more water in here. I mean, this doesn't work logically. It just doesn't work. Uh, we might be able to put a wall back here. Oh. Um... Then we could mine this out, or to if we put a wall, if we got a wall back here, uh, we could remove this and remove 
Hmm. Hmm. Pumping, I don't think it's, I think what, I think it's silly what I'm trying now, uh, because obviously we're just pumping water back into itself and that doesn't work. Uh, but, oh, okay. So they got Snowflake's body and they are now going to bury her. I feel better about that. We have some scaffolding now into the trees so it won't happen again. Knock wood. Okay. Whoops. Okay, so she's pumping, and yeah, look, it looks like she's not drowning. Uh, or she's not getting pushed around. Water is getting pumped here. And it is just coming back into here. You can see the mist. So it is, it is working to some extent. For example, I could get rid of this block. There's no good reason to do that, I don't think. Hmm. But this is interesting. Um. Hmm. Hmm. I just had an idea. I just realized something. Hold on. Let me build... Can I build a wall right here? Uh, not right now, but maybe in a second. Um, hmm. I just realized that I probably, I might have been able to salvage this whole thing if I hadn't removed that wall. But I did. But I did. What I could do... Hmm. Huh. I don't think she... I don't think she can pump fast enough to make... To make... Whoops. Uh, to make this piece... Oh, it is one out of seven right now. Build construction wall. Right there. Okay. This might take a while to accomplish, but if we can do it, my thinking is that if just this one side is done, maybe we don't even have to worry about this side and we can just go, like maybe this will dry up here because this area is not aquifer. I think. That's my, I'm gonna try it. It's worth a shot. It's worth a shot as opposed to just abandoning the whole thing. Indigo is fighting. Why is Indigo fighting? Indigo is fighting with a spider monkey? What happened? What? What happened here? Uh. Wait, turkey? Okay, so a turkey was fighting Indigo. That's fine. All right, and then here, a spider monkey. Um. The spider monkey misses the farmer. The farmer put so the I guess the spider monkey attacked first. Expedition leader. The expedition leader I thought was Scat. So maybe Scat's fighting as well. Oh no, Bullhead is the expedition leader. They're both fighting with the spider monkey. Right here. And there's the spider monkey. Okay, let's look at the health of uh, Bullhead and, uh, and, uh, and, uh, who, whoever else was just fighting. Scat. Okay, you, I don't see any health things here. Oh, maybe you need a, I don't know. Um, Scat, where are you? Okay. Sleeping. Oh, it was Indigo, right? Indigo. What was I thinking? Indigo. How come there's no health tab here? There usually is. It's because we don't have a doctor anymore because our doctor was Snowflake. 
We need a new doctor. Okay. Um, let's make... Um, who do we make a doctor? Uh, I say we make Indigo our doctor. Uh, what's it, what is it going to be under? Other jobs? No. Um, oh, healthcare. Whoops. Yep, we're going to do all that. All right, Indigo is now a doctor. And now, um, we should be able to view health. No? Maybe she needs to be a doctor for a little bit. I don't know. But it did help me realize that we don't have a doctor. Why is it, what is the, wrong with this spider monkey? I hope we weren't hurt. Our poor dwarves. Okay. All right, so we're pumping. Uh, construction and active. So we'll wait for a dwarf to come down and start that up. Okay. Okay. Um, I think this is going to take a long time because there's so much water down here that it's only like at one out of seven depth of water for where only like a little bit at a, a time. I'm worried about the spider monkeys. Like, I really hope we're not hurt. Let's see if we can see now. Bullhead. Am I looking at the wrong thing? I thought that's where the health health tab was. There's indigo. Can I look at health? General? Uh, I thought it was status and then health. Oh, kills? Oh, you killed the spider monkey. Okay, good job, indigo. Good job. Yeah, so I guess the spider monkey eventually died. And it looks like indigo... The last attack was Indigo punching the spider monkey in the left front foot and it exploding in a lump of gore, uh, opening up an artery. So that's what eventually killed the spider monkey. I don't see anything here where the spider monkey attacked, um, where the spider monkey did any damage. So I think everyone's okay. Yeah, I think... Oh, the spider monkey became enraged for whatever reason. But Indigo actually, Indigo and uh, Bullhead, it looks like, did an okay job defending themselves and eventually killed the spider monkey. So, that's good. Okay, and it looks like uh, Friendly died. Friendly died visiting the tomb of uh, snails. And... Uh, at least at least that means it won't be a long trip from where he died to his own tomb, which is right over here. Alright. It's still just waiting for construction. What it has Is this blood? Why is there blood here? Oh, it's spider monkey blood. Okay. So I think Indigo went down to help construction and the blood that she was co she was covered with the spider monkey's blood and it washed off. I was afraid that was our door's blood. Okay. All right, Indigo, come on, keep helping me out here. Keep helping me. Uh, Serenity's gonna get thirsty pretty soon. So many animals. Whoops. Come on. I forgot. I knew that I wanted to try this too. Like just going down here with the wall. But I forgot about it. I could have saved us a lot of time. Okay. Come on guys. Come on dwarves. Someone help out. What's everyone doing? What's everyone doing they can't help out? What are you doing? Rendering fat. Mm, probably don't really need to be doing that. Although, yeah, our meals are fine. 
don't know what you're going to do with all that fat. <laughs> Serenity's just pumping. She's like, come on, someone, anyone. I wish you could just pump when someone went down there to do the job. They're not that smart. Hmm. Oh, okay. Still hasn't started construction, but... I don't like that all our doors are, like, all except one of our, well, no, I guess two, <laughs> I guess only two of our doors are the same color. Um, that, like, br like, brown, brownish color. But Serenity is bright yellow and Bullhead is white. Where are you taking that body? His tomb is over here. That's Friendly's tomb, and aren't you carrying Friendly? Uh, where's your inventory? Hi. Yeah, you're carrying Friendly's corpse. What are you doing with it? You're going the wrong direction. Where do you... Bury him. Go bury him. Where are you bringing him? Uh... I don't know what she's doing with Friendly's body. Are you not bringing it up here? Why are you bringing it into the kitchen? I don't like this. Did I set one of these stockpiles to store human corpses? What the what? Okay. Corpse stockpile. You shouldn't be, you shouldn't have human corpses in here. Okay, clearly I did not, that's not good. Do not want that. I should have made this Animals? Maybe not animals. I don't know what. Refuse? And the refuse would just be corpses? Whoops. Yeah, that's what I'm thinking. It probably should have been like that. Yeah. I guess now that's a good lesson. Corpses is just like your own corpses, I think. It is a little confusing. Look at all these bones here. This is just a boneyard. Spider oh, they're all spider monkey teeth. I think we could probably put those in a bin or something, right? Instead of just having one at each square. And turkey bones. Uh, okay, how are we doing here? Still waiting for construction. I am glad that we're able to continue to use the screw pump, though. That does make me feel better. Okay, now they're, at least they're burying him now. Still waiting for construction. We can't get a break with that. That's going to take a long time, I think. <sighs> he, I was like, oh, well, at least he died really close to his tomb, and we carried him all the way to our kitchen, and now carrying all the way back. <sighs> all right, put him in the casket. Okay. I think that'll about wrap up today's episode, everybody. So leave a like if you liked. Please subscribe, and uh, I will see you next time. Thanks, everybody.